Hello, this reading is for those who just recently broke up or had a fallout with your partner. I'll do three spreads. The situation spread, who you're dealing with, who left who, etc. The advice spread, is it worth your time to reconcile with this ex? And the new love in the near future spread. Do you have anybody new coming towards you, hopefully better suited for you than your ex? Please like my videos if they resonate and subscribe to my channel. Let's begin. Here's the situation, Capricorn. We've got the Seven of Cups, Judgment, Ten of Wands, and the Eight of Cups. Unfortunately, um, I don't see a particular person who you're dealing with, even though I wasn't asking for it, but uh, the picture is still pretty clear to me. Uh, the Judgment card is here. This is a card of somebody usually trying to come back. Uh, perhaps you're, you were dealing with an ex or you had to make some sort of a judgment call regarding this particular person. The Seven of Cups here is a card of a confusion. We also have the Ten of Wands, which is a card of a burden, and uh, the Eight of Cups is the outcome here, and this is the card of you walking away. Keep in mind, this could be vice versa, but I think since this is a spread about you, then um, that was you who were dealing with either an ex, like I said, or you had to make a judgment call because whatever situation you were in, it was becoming uh, too much of a burden for you and you were really confused by the situation, so you had to make a call to walk away from this person. Let's see what the advice is for you, Capricorn. We've got the Magician, we also have Temperance, the Three of Cups, and the Four of Swords. I think the uh, advice here is pretty clear. Um, manifest something new for yourself. Take some time off to heal the situation and uh, perhaps go out and enjoy your time with your friends or go to some sort of events or showcases or what have you. Um, so just to uh, go over it one more time. The Magician is a card of somebody who is actively manifesting something. The Temperance is a card of either a Sagittarius or this is a card of healing the situation, just taking a step back. And the Three of Cups is a card of a celebration or a reunion. And the Four of Swords is a card of, you know, taking a break, uh, taking some time off to think about it or perhaps go on vacation. So like I said, I think the advice here is just to chill out, and manifest something new in your life. Let's see if there is any new love coming towards you, Capricorn. We've got the Eight of Wands, the Seven of Swords, the Magician, the Wheel of Fortune, and the World underneath the deck, on the bottom of the deck. Um, I do see somebody new who is actively manifesting you into their life, but I'm really not sure about the Seven of Swords card here. The Seven of Swords card is a card of a cheater, a card of a deception, or a card of somebody who is up to no good. And we also have three cards that can uh, indicate trouble. The Eight of Wands, the Wheel of Fortune, and the World. And the World is a card of somebody who could potentially be living in another city or even in another country, right? something that's over or someone who is uh, overseas so if you do meet somebody new perhaps while you're traveling or if you meet them online and they're in another country be very careful with that person because they could potentially be up to no good the seven of swords is here for a reason right so unfortunately there is no a card there's no cards here indicating the sign of the person, but like I said in the near future, in March, if you start communicating with somebody, especially if they're overseas or if you meet them while traveling, be very careful, they could be up to no good. And there you have it. I hope my readings resonated with you and if they did, I hope they make your lives better in one way or the other. Please share and subscribe and hit the bell to get notified. Thank you for watching.